Good kitten internet. Yeah. Uh, we are back with more Starfield. I don't believe anybody thought otherwise. <laughs> uh, where we last left off, we just returned to our ship. We are still on the moon that the extremophile, even though it's totally... Or not extremophile, um... Extremomorph. Which is totally a terror morph. Terror morph, that's what it is. Um, I've thrown junk down. I have also now seen a very short clip of somebody throwing way more junk down than I ever have thought of. Mm -hmm. It was a clip of... This door was closed, so let me just close it really fast to mirror it. And you can sort of see what was behind there through the glass, but they walked up, opened the hatch, and out rolled out all of their potatoes that they crammed inside of the cockpit. Huh. Think... Probably 100,000 potatoes? Okay. And just kept rolling out with a random NPC commenting that you really need to stop collecting so much stuff. <laughs> oh yeah, we still have a cough. And this, we still have lung damage. Yeah. But our prognosis is good now, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. yeah, I think it's good at this point. Uh, yep, it's good. So maybe it'll actually go away on its own. Yeah, maybe. Ah. I need to move the keyboard closer. Or just... Nope. Oh, crap. I moved the camera. That's not going to work. One moment. Do, 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 do. I know what I need to do. Rotate. Or... Ah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, There we go. Either editor me will crop that out, or not, because I'm really lazy when it comes to stuff like that. Volume's up. I need to use remote control for volume. I have the remote control next to me. I know I didn't drop it this time. What? No, not done. Although I do want to use this. It's highlighted, but, but you can't pick it up? I can't do anything with it. Like, if I highlight these, it shows me what it is. Hmm. But these are just blank. That's not, but that's just a water pitcher. Also, you are not breaking bread. Yeah, I know. No, I don't have any work meetings today. Um, and let's go into inventory and deal with the over-encumbered problem by dropping crap. Oh. Has that always Cargo been there? Pulled. So we do have a cargo hold, and it holds 450. Okay. And we can store things in the cargo hold. Alright, guess where all of this crap is going. I mean, almost all of it. You're throwing holes, including ammo and things you might actually need. Oh, uh... Maybe you should go by category. Yeah, I thought I was in the category. Ship parts. That should probably go in the ship. Um... Resources in the ship. Okay. Back to the miscellaneous category that I thought I was in. Oh, it's my artifact. And it's a quest item. And I heard the washer beep. Yep. Which means that one of us is going to have to go to at least open the washing machine. Or we can just post the report. I can... I'm just dropping off inventory stuff. Yeah. So... I will not proceed with anything until I am until you are back. Gone. Really love them, by the way. I know this is a secret to absolutely nobody.
And yes, that is the washing machine that I complained about in a previous video. I love how I have notepad, 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 and notepads as separate items. So many succulents. There. I'm still overburdened. Your spinal health will be compromised yes, by I'm carrying nice. so many items. I'm just picking up the rest of this so I can go back to the cargo hold. Yes, uh, this needs to be... Ah. Be standing in a specific spot for the cargo hold. That explains why I didn't find it before. Anyway, my resources. All of this gets stuffed into the cargo hold. Oh, those buttons store all resources. Notes. Not a button to stuff all notes, though. Good to know. Um, let's. So that's better at thermal and corrosive resistance and heavier, but way worse at airborne and radiation resistance. I don't think that's worth it to me, but I don't know. I only have the tunnel mining pack. Time for the helmets. All of the spare helmets. Apparel. I'm currently wearing a minor utility outfit, which gives me plus five health and O2. So I do have mines and grenades. At some point I'm going to need to learn how to use those. Miscellaneous stuff. That has to stay. My mass is now at 99. That's better. I don't need this many weapons though, so let's store some of the weapons. Oh, I have three cutters. Okay. Well, let's store two of them. Not using the Vapor Eons anymore, because I have the Med Theft one. I'm back. Oh. Welcome back. I'm going to Alt-Tab to make sure that you're in view. You are not? No, you aren't. Okay. Um, all I've been doing is putting things in, and I've made a couple of discoveries. So, after I'm done with what I'm currently putting in, which is all of the excess weapons. Oops, did not mean to put in all of the axes. Give me one axe, please. Thank you. Um... I don't really need both the cornered and boosted. I'll put the cornered away and equip the boosted. Equip the speed. Okay. So, one of the things that I discovered, and this might be part of the reason why I didn't notice it. So, opening up inventory. Without pressing cargo hold here, you can't actually put things in the cargo hold. So, like, for instance, going into miscellaneous... I don't have the option to put things in the cargo hold. Hmm. I actually have to specifically open up the cargo hold menu, then switch to inventory, and now I have the option of putting things into the cargo hold. Hmm. I don't know why the clunky menu, though. 
Oh, um, the second thing was a very silly thing. So I have many notepads. Mm -hmm. But I also have notepads. Yeah, that's two notepads. Yep, but... Why are those separate objects instead of just two separate notepads? I don't know. <laughs> that was all I was pointing out. Okay. Oh wow, I go zoom now. Yeah, you're not super encumbered. Mm, who would have thought? Also, the gravity is kind of low here, I think. Yeah, that's fair. Um, the next thing I wanted to check before I left... Do I have access to the things in the cargo hold from my research station? Yes. Because this says I have tungsten, which I only have in my cargo hold. Okay. That answers that question. Okay. Now, before I do anything else, I am quick saving. Really don't understand why it's not registering my keyboard every time for, hmm. like, menu options. Maybe you should make a proper save. Okay. Ah, it's nighttime outside now. Ready? Mm -hmm. Oh, um. Do I want to finish scout air scanning the, the planet? Surveying? Yeah. On here. So. Okay. Well, now that I'm not over encumbered, mm -hmm. there shouldn't be any. And you have your hard. mining laser with you? Yes. It's like bringing a pickaxe and scar him. Mm hmm. Right. I don't need it equipped. I keep forgetting. You don't? Nope. Because if I am in scanning mode, that's what comes out, no matter what. So, um, looks like I need some of the fauna scans and some more resources. Keep forgetting, I still have a call. Like that. where I was at, right? That was the place with the level 5 things? So I should go a different way. It's also really hard to see anything. Yeah, maybe you should just sleep until morning. Oh, that's new. Guess I see the thermal vent. I'm assuming that's too big for my mining laser. Yeah. I have got to be able to get a better mining laser. Maybe I should just leave so I can get a better set of equipment before going anywhere else. Yeah, I think I should probably just leave. But surveying. I know, but I can come back. But it might be that I don't have the right equipment to continue surveying. Although I've now found all of the resources, I have not found all of the flora and fauna. But also my cough. I would like to get rid of that cough. Yeah, let's just head back. Yeah. Ooh, pretty. I know there was a way to fast travel back, but... And yes, that is the quest line marker. It only shows up when you're in the scan view. 
useful. Mm-hmm. That's a good guy. On the back of the ship. Or front, or... It, it's hard to define. Yeah, in Fallout 4, you, you can take a perch to show you the uh, line to your quest objective. Um, in Skyrim, it's a spell. Mm-hmm. That you just cast when you do. And 90% of the time it works. There are a few places where the game gets really confused about which path you should take and it doesn't work, or it sends you in the wrong direction. We blast off. That's gonna take this really long time to get there. That's why you should grab jump. Yes. Now, if only I knew how to do that. Already forgotten a good jump controls. Well, there's the boost. That's shooty. That's other shooty. That's third shooty. They really needed to have the tutorial not go quite that fast. Yep. The control, control alt. Yeah, it was alt. Okay, well, Rav Drive is now fully powered. Fully powered. I'm wondering if you just leave the seat and go to the navigation console. That would make sense. Alpha Centauri. 1,105,000... Or, no, I'm sorry. 1,010,952 hours. Okay. Um, I'm going to take the boost because I don't want to take a little while to get there. That's why you grab jump. Apparently that's how you do it. Oh. Um, select the mission. Mm -hmm. Tell it to grab jump. Starship Frontier, this is United Colony Security. Maintain course and prepare to be scanned. Scan complete. No contraband detected. You are cleared for landing at New Atlantis. There's a lot of ships here. Mm -hmm. I think we're supposed to be able to interact with ships? Yeah, but let's not right now. Yeah. Okay. How do I do this again? Okay, that gives me information about that. We're supposed to be going to New Atlantis. Open planet map. Sure, scan the planet. Okay. Uh, we need to... That landing target, uh, land at New Atlantis. And... United Colonies is a stable and peaceful place to live. Many argue it is the height of civilization in the settled systems. I need to give your legs more space. We have made it to civilization, apparently.
pelvis at last time. Ooh, our frame rate has plummeted for some reason. Hmm. Sleep for three hours. Maybe that will heal us? Looks like it. And we awaken while rested. But with a cough. Why is our frame rate so garbage right now? Because we're at New Atlantis. But we're in our ship. Yeah, we're in the ship. Hey, Bosco. What? No bears? Let me guess. Protocol indigo again? Your memory is. And he's our new captain. My crew can take a look at your ship. And you can stop by the Trade Authority kiosk if you need to offload some cargo. Thousand credits for repairs. We did get hit, so we should mm -hmm. have it. Nothing for us to do during this flying condition. Or not. <laughs> mm -hmm. Let me see what ships you have for sale. I'm, I'm sure, sure you can find something you like. I'm sure I can't afford anything. So the Rambler costs 57,600 credits. We have a tenth of that. Mm -hmm. What else do we have? Galileo. Not going to be able to afford that one anytime soon. The Econo Hall. Field Breaker. 280,000 credits. It has lasers. Mm -hmm. Lots of them. And this... Yeah. Anyway. Okay, no problem. I can modify things. Shipbuilder! Shipbuilder allows you to fully design, modify, and paint your ship. Floor gauge to the right tells you when where new modules will appear. When the floor gauge is at zero, for example, new modules will be placed at the center of mass on the ship. Building new ship modules will cost credits, and deleting them will give you your credits back. Ah, we can even left control for options. That's not giving me options. What? Oh, we can definitely change colors. We can attach weapons. Weapons almost look to be within our price range. Remember, we have to have some money for our mortgage payment. Oh, I know. Payment. I said almost. Um... I have no idea what I'm doing. Let's just do a little more thought. Yeah. Uh, cancel modification, please, and exit. I would try the viewport. They'll be on your left once you get into the plaza. Right. Thank you. Everything looks good here. I'll be at my booth if you need me. Great authority kiosk. Oh, it's not letting me sell things that are in my cargo hold. Cargo hold. But the that's, way it's phrased, weird. it said that I could. Yeah, offload cargo. Yeah. Like, I can sell these things, but... Well, They're that's annoying. Really 
Especially when the ship's right here. Mm-hmm. I thought the whole point was that you could sell things from your cargo. I access my cargo from here? No. Well, I'm not selling anything yet then. Let's follow plot slightly longer. I can assure you this unprovoked attack on the United Colonies research facility will not go unanswered. We'll get you settled into your new assignments as soon as possible. For you, Bobby, that includes meeting your new foster parent. My parents aren't dead. They just took a different shuttle. I'll see them when they get here. Oh, well, of course, uh, that's sure possible. Uh, we'll, ju uh, we'll just... Helena Chambers, ID SSCOM 1327HCHA. I was the station administrator. I'll need to report to Mask ASAP for a full debrief. My treatment thus far has been entirely unacceptable. Any authority you had was forfeit the moment House Baroon Zealots breached the station's perimeter and you failed to initiate proper evacuation protocols. Thank you for your service. We'll find you a new position commensurate with your experience. And Mr. Bosch, let me just say how honored I am to meet you. By all accounts, you're the only reason anyone made it out of there alive. I'm oh, just glad I still remembered my flight basics. It had been a while. So was shooting a gun. I read all about New Atlantis. So cool! Is it true that the Nat goes 5,000 miles an hour? Or that citizens get special discounts? Or that the whole city celebrates when it's your birthday? <laughs> Mine's June 11th, by the way. My parents took me to Aquila City last year. It kind of smelled. But I don't smell anything here. Um, no, yes, no, and I will certainly mark June 11th on my calendar. As for Aquila City, well, the air purifiers here in New Atlantis are a state of the art. You have air purifiers? Aquila City? Oh, don't even get me started on those simpletons. A little unfair, don't you think? Free Star Rangers helped me out quite a bit a couple years back. Got ambushed by spacers near Narion. They assisted, no questions asked. <coughs> Even helped with some repairs so I could do an emergency jump home. Good people. In any event, you all must be exhausted. Just give me a moment to coordinate some details with security. Hi. I've never been in a battle before. Everyone kept telling me to keep my eyes closed, but it's kind of hard to do that when you're running. At first, I thought it was ecliptic mercenaries shooting at us, but it wasn't. There's these other people, you know, about serpents and stuff. Probably. I'm pretty brave. A kid tried to bully me once, and I punched him in the head. Good going, kid. Don't take shit from anybody, my mother says. And I don't. Anyway, I'm fine now. I hope my parents don't take too long getting here. Hello? Guess you caught some of that, huh? The galaxy is at peace and somehow seems more dangerous than ever. Oh, Spacers, House Maroon, Crimson Fleet, everyone trying to grab their peace. What happened to the early days, huh? When we just float through the stars and dream. I'm damage cured. I just had to talk to a doctor. <laughs> Who, who, who's House Maroon? Not what? Who? How to describe House Maroon? Well, imagine a, a bunch of colonists who set off into the stars ages ago, disappeared, and then re-emerged as a sort of religious society. Faction, or cult, whatever you want to call them. They believe in some sort of celestial deity called the Great Serpent. Real nightmare fuel kind of stuff. About a hundred years back, they picked a fight with pretty much every one of the seven systems. I guess your school never covered the Serpent's Crusade, huh? We eventually made peace, sort of. Then they just disappeared. They're out there somewhere. 
Or so folks assume. From the ones that attacked us, they were the hardliners, for sure. You meet those guys, you run. You understand me? Well, no. <laughs> you don't know how glad I am to hear you say that. I'm right here with you, my friend. How can you not look up to the cosmos and just be overwhelmed by its beauty? So much possibility, so much hope, even despite recent events. Yep, that I have. Had to dump a load of cargo just last year. Microscopes, can you believe that? Guess you I think I found a few of them. Days. Pirates are a tricky lot. In space, they're all about the hit and run. You jump in, steal your stuff, and get out of there fast. Keep your cool, and you can generally talk your way out of it, so long as you're not too attached to your valuables. Stumble upon them planet side, though, and their trigger fingers get much itchier. Ricardo Walsh. I was the lead researcher on the station that got attacked. It was business as usual until those House Varun crazies swarmed in, spouting their scripture, whatever it was. Even the Marines were overwhelmed. Honestly, I'm just lucky to have made it out of there in one piece. We all are. Now, I just want to get back to work. Where is that woman? Really? <laughs> you must have been hiding under a moon rock your whole life if you've managed to dodge those assholes. <sighs> They're basically a bunch of space scumbags. Fly around, attack, and rob anyone they see. They're pretty disorganized and easy to fend off until they aren't. They're a different beast than the Crimson Fleet. Generally speaking, pirates want your stuff, so they can occasionally be reasoned with. Spacers, though. They tend to shoot first and ask questions never. Sounds like they have an interesting choice. Space is true. Another time. Oh, yes. no, just, uh, go away. She can't do this to me. Not now. Well, I didn't want to talk to her anyway. Yeah, not particularly, but... Keep your nose clean. Last thing I want is to charge you for a DP, an A and B, B and E, or heaven forbid, an LS. But at least then we wouldn't have to worry about the VOP. Am I right? Uh, sure. Does that woman have any idea who I am? Well, this definitely feels like the space equivalent of an airport. Beware of rocket blast! Proceed to airport security. them speak different languages. I'm busy at the moment. Although that looked like large fun. Hi there. Theft. So for reference, since it's probably not obvious on the recording, this is only running at around 50 frames per second right now. Hopefully the recording is not getting messed up, because I can't tell as it is right now. Welcome to New Atlantis, the capital of the United Colonies, and for many, the settled systems as a whole. You stand now in the most technologically advanced city the human race has ever conceived and constructed. New Atlantis was founded in the year 2156, the same year we first arrived in the Alpha Centauri star system. And if you're a resident, then you're already familiar with your fantastic home. And if you're a visitor, you're an honored guest of the United Colonies and will be treated as such. Our courteous and professional security personnel can be found all over the city, and it's their job to ensure your time in New Atlantis is joyful, lawful, and productive. 
So as you stroll the streets or take the Nat train to the city's different districts, know that you're in the embrace of the United Colonies and couldn't be in better hands. <laughs> Very polished surface. Is it rotten at the core? Yeah, I'm assuming so. Uh, apparently, Earth became uninhabitable in 2203. Sounds about right. Actually, I think it might be earlier than that. Ah, Chunks' headquarters is in the residential district. Okay. This place always surprised me. So I have been told that New Atlantis is some of the hardest on the computer areas to load. Because each NPC is using up its own CPU algorithm. Uh. Each individual figure so it's basically overwhelming my computer and bethesda still can't write a multi-court game worth it hey there I'm apparently supposed to go to the mass district this is the one that goes at five thousand miles an hour as the kid said was it miles the kid actually said miles and not kilometers. Hmm. I do like how everybody's dressed differently. Yeah. One day, I'm gonna leave New Atlantis for good. You're a person. I need to. I have a feeling today's going to be a great day. Don't you agree? I don't think that's a crew member. Oh, hi there. I'm doing great. Yeah, How that sounds like a crew member. But if you change your mind, let me know. Glad to hear it. Yeah. Life is good, isn't it? Yeah, I love that much because you're Yeah. So that I can go explore the settled systems with my boyfriend, Tony. He's cheating on you. I think we're finally getting first. <laughs> you... Honestly, she actually doesn't look that tired, but really? Well, I guess you're right. Feeling a bit run down. I really love my job, but it's hard work and long hours. I could definitely use the Terracino from Terrible right now. Why not? Really? That's so sweet. I really appreciate it. Tony and I want to see what else is out there. I love my job, but there has to be more to life than just being a janitor in New Atlantis. What about you? Being you a janitor in the ship? Yeah. That's amazing. I'm so jealous. One day you'll have to tell me and Tony all about them, okay? And I'm basically five hours old, but whatever. <laughs> well, that depends. Are you a foodie or a shopper? Uh, yeah. If that's the case, you have a lot of options here in New Atlantis. Dawn's Roost is... But, I'll be honest, I'm more of a chunks girl, and my boyfriend and I can't get enough of Terra Brew. I'm sorry, the fact that they named the corporation Chunks. Interesting advertising design. Your eyes are haunting me. They're crying, thanks. Mm-hmm. Anything in them moving? Not seeing anything. Which is unfortunate. Maybe they're just for uh, air quality. Could be. Like those algae tank things. Mm -hmm. Convincer that President Abeo isn't the same as her predecessors. And that an adversarial UC is a thing of the past. 
Radcliffe even need to be involved? President Abeo wants to foster relations, not president. We'll make sure she knows my name. Good. I'll we have multiple conversations and... I really wish you could see all the subtitles, because... Yes. Yeah, I, I can't hear what they're saying without the subtitles. Yeah, it's showing that you're pressing B, but... Yes. I don't know where this place is. And I am not getting any... Any indication of anything. Well, I guess we're gonna wander for a bit. Or I can reactivate the... Whatchamacallit, uh, main quest. There's supposed to be a scientist by the tree. I'm assuming this is the tree in question. Yeah. Gorgeous weather today, huh? You have a name. If I moved back, back to Neon, I'd miss New Atlantis like crazy. Yeah, I work at MAST, in the Office of Interstellar Affairs. I'm a sort of liaison between the UC and the Free Star Collective. I help solve communication problems, show visiting diplomats the city, things like that. Probably doesn't sound all that exciting to you, but I love it. I've been interested in a diplomatic career since I was a kid. No, I'm from Neon. I moved here a couple months ago for a job at the Office of Interstellar Affairs. Oh, I love it. I think New Atlantis is the most beautiful place in the settled systems. I can't believe how many trees there are in the city. Trees are important. Thanks. Maybe I'll see you around. Where's the scientist? He has a name and it look he looks like a scientist. I'm yes. sorry, I really can't afford to be distracted. I need to get to the bottom. Somebody is giving a quest, at least. Mm -hmm. Seem to be staring at a tree. I am not staring. I am analyzing. This is important xenobiological work. I work for the scientific division of MAST. I've been studying this tree for quite some time, and it appears to be exhibiting some worrying signs. What's wrong with the tree? Are you familiar with this particular specimen? Do you understand its importance? Please info them on us. Look, I have a lot of work to do here. If you're just going to gawk. I'd ask that you move on. If you can actually assist me, however, I would appreciate it. I don't normally solicit help from random passersby, but it seems an exception is necessary. Would you be willing to retrieve some additional data for me? I'd love to help. Well, that's... Thank you. That's unexpected. <laughs> ah, there's a series of biosensors I've placed in various locations around New Atlantis, all calibrated to gather pertinent information. They've been running for long enough that I think it's time to collect and analyze their findings. If okay. I can do that once I know what the hell they look like, but we have quest markers. Quest markers, at least. And I'll have to keep an eye out for where the Chunks place is. Although, Chunks' home is in the residential district. We're going to Terrapur. Right, which was mentioned in the context of Chunks, so I wonder if it's a Chunks own business. Mm, I think so. Mm. That being said, there's people who might have watched Yeah, I yeah, was continuing to loop around the. That is a beautiful tree. That is. I want to quite hug it. Tree. I'm sorry they don't have VR mode on this, and my VR headset's in Notre Dame somewhere. Citizen? Citizen? Oh, oh hey, what's, what's up? up? There are other large trees, though, which is good. I definitely miss having a map. Just a local map. You don't have a map? No. Oh, show on map. Surface map. 
This is my map. Hmm. And it's like, this is not not helpful. Yeah. Maybe I get a map by more exploring the world. That is possible. We may be in nope. a United Colonies city, but Constellation is an entirely neutral entity, and it always has been. I'm sorry. Mr. Dibley? Mr. Dwayne Dibley? What? Almost, yeah. Almost, yeah. That's what's that <laughs> my head to stop it going, I'm sorry? There's one. You're just admiring your trees. The Wills yes. are having brownouts all the time. Mast finally sent someone down there, but nothing's changed. <laughs> now we have another mission. Yep. Can't be a Bethesda game without having thousands of side quests all at once, right? Yeah, because we have to fix everything. Nothing happens without us. Ever. Yeah, I can have been wanting a game where you take a mission to go on and other adventuring groups take some of the quests you don't. Spotlights on the tree. Okay. Ah, medical facility. Which we don't need anymore because- But I'm going to buy- mm -hmm. We have an appointment. You're seeing the doctor. That's it. I- maybe some other time. I have a report that's due. I talked to your boss. She agreed that you need to take it first. This genuinely looks like a doctor's office. We offer only the best care in Atlantis. If there's anything you need, please don't hesitate to ask. Welcome to Reliant. If you're in need of medical assistance or require supplies, I am sure we can accommodate you. I'm using medical supplies. Mm. Well, you certainly, certainly come, come to the, the right, right place. place. Well, that's actually what we needed. Find one of those. It doesn't tell me how many I have, does it? I think you have one or two? I know I have at least one med pack. Mm -hmm. Just, I would like to know which ones I'm missing. I think you have a, a heal paste. I don't think I have a heart plus. Pretty sure you don't. But that's also a buff and not... Mm -hmm. Do I have an immobilizer? I don't think so. I mean, they're not that expensive. The med pack on the other yeah, hand is. Yeah, and junk plush is expensive. I'll buy one bandages. Well, of course, New Atlantis is a big place. Lots of people, which means no shortage of injuries, communicable diseases. But we're well set and do our best to accommodate anyone who needs help. So, what brings you in today? You don't need me for anything. You look to be in better health than I am. Mm. So, an improvement over Fallout 4, where you have to tell them which symptom yes. you're treating. But Take care of yourself. you can actually tell that you don't have any symptoms. Good. That is stealing. thing in Fallout 4 that's kind of stupid is if you have a little bit of limb damage but your health is at full you can't get your limb damage healed hmm that is kind of silly I'm not sure if 
if that also applies if you have an actual broken limb. Orion Tower, EIT Clothiers. That's Reliant Medical still. But I am going toward that one that's within 60. just go blurry? Yeah, because I ran out of... Yeah. You had a little red blip on the CO2 yep. because you... Basically, when you drop below... Uh, when you drop... When you are out of stamina, you start taking health damage. Yeah. You can keep running, but it's not good for you. Right. CJ's open 49 hours a day. What is CJ's? Cafeteria? Thanks for stopping by. What brings you in? Brings me in is the fact that I can't talk to you from CJ's there. is always open. No matter what, what you need, need, when you need it, I'm here. Given that your name's Curtis, I'm assuming you're the C. I've got all your bases right here. You have baguettes. Mmm. And boom bop. Looks like all the flavors of boom pop seem to do the same thing. You. Mm. Can yuck bacon butter. Wait, so butter exists. Then why do the grilled cheeses not require it? A grilled cheese without butter is just melted cheese on a piece of bread. Yeah. Speaking of, why does the cheese look like butter? It's even the same weight. Although the net weight on there is labeled differently, even though the actual masses. I suppose it would be weight versus mass. But grams measures mass anyway. These for everyone. Chunks. Okay, so milk exists. Yep. Formulated for health. Kefir exists. Okay. Ooh, pizza squares. Synthetic by nature. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> um... Is it there... okay? Uh, bread, I guess, is real food, but is there, yeah, carrot. Carrots are real. Celery is real. There is real food. Not everything is packaged. Cheese flavored. Hungry. Mm, yeah, me too. There's the gummy bugs that I have. So many different foods. Wait, Terra Brew, what was the Terra Brew that we needed? Was it classic? Mm. Let's get one of each. Tranquility, udon noodles, and yogurt. Nice and steady, just, just the way, way I like. I've got, got a good, good location, location, plenty of foot traffic, traffic and a ton, ton of people who are in a hurry and need to make a quick stop for the essentials. Things, things keep going this way, way. I'm going to start opening franchises, franchises all over the seven systems. Are you kidding me? Nowhere else like it in the seven system. First time I came here as a kid, I knew I was going to come back and make my mark on this city. Nowhere I'd rather be. And now that I've got this place up and running, it's all coming together. Be seen. I'm gonna check your quest log to see which copy. 
cappuccino. So neither of them. Was it espresso and classic? Yes. Mm. What if this is a sub quest and every copper shop had two different copies but not the one you need? It is possible. Athena Tower. I think there's a couple of towers that we've seen so far. Let's just go into one. Not stealing. They forgot to set the. Maybe this. It might Maybe. be. We have a house, don't we? In a tower apartment. This was opened with a computer. I am guessing that we have the ability to buy this place. Maybe. Where is our dream home? I don't know. That we're paying a mortgage for. I really don't know. Well, we haven't paid yet. We haven't been here for a week. <laughs> right, but... Uh... Yeah. Maybe we can... Try going to the bank. Yeah, there's banks here. Yeah, I remember there was a bank. All of a sudden, got darker. Okay. In the um... the directory type of thing. A carefully prepared system ambush almost resulted in disaster. A big surprise. The contents came damaged. Well, know what they say. say. There's the other apartment building. Another, another apartment building. Centurion Arsenal. I'm assuming weapons. Ever wonder how the Crimson Fleet seems to be everywhere? No, I'm not wondering. It just spawn in. Yeah. Security monitoring on premises. Maybe we... Maybe we can get a better mining laser. You know, just by walking through that door, you've shown you make good decisions. No. I like that about you. I don't make good decisions. It is my absolute pleasure to assist you with any purchases or questions you may have. All sales are final, but that won't matter because you will undoubtedly be pleased with your purchase. You have my word. Is that a surprise? These are... Potential yeah. matters of I, that is a good about. point. Well, that's not a simple question, is it? It all depends on who's asking. Hmm. I have my own personal favorites, but I wouldn't presume to know yours. Tell me, were you to find yourself in the unfortunate position of needing to use a weapon, what suits you best? Something up close and personal? Rapid fire? Is precision a consideration? Like, I'm not moving the mouse when I angle mm. down. It's just easier if everything explodes. I don't care as long as I'm still standing at the end. <laughs> I see. Well, I'm afraid grenades are not something you carry. The liability is just... It's not a personal choice of mine. But... Well, that's not a simple... Hmm. Tell me, where did you find something up close? Ah, yes. Well, if efficiency is a priority, then you really can't go wrong with allied armaments. They've been supplying the UC for years, and for good reason. Holding my head down. Let's have a look. I'm sure we can find something that suits you. That's a lot of different types of ammo. Yeah. That's going to be hard to memorize. Yep. But I know all the ammo types in Fallout 4, so I'm sure I can learn this too. Yep, I was just checking. Yep. It's been How long about an hour? Power? We did start recording before, or we started the timer before. Yeah, by less than a minute. Yeah. So shotguns are a thing. Laser pistols. Rifles. The one rare rifle, although that's a lot of mods on that one rifle. 
It also costs way more than what we have. Yeah, it's rare. Along with the 50 bajillion Grendels and Neons. Uh, no mining laser? No mining laser. No. So maybe we should uh, end it here? I'm, there's one of those beacons very close by. Okay, we'll grab that. Yeah. I mean, I, I want to keep my... Just gonna stop in to see what chunks looks like. Cabernet Rouge or Cola Zero, excuse me. Oh. Welcome to Chunks. Please choose your Chunks. Chunks are the highest quality ingredients sourced from all over the settled systems, and uh, I forget the rest. <laughs> <laughs> I like him. I don't know. Smaller chunks? <laughs> it's chunks all the way down. Honestly, you're probably better off not thinking about it. <laughs> Great. What can I get for you? Chunks, 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 chunks. Ships align cereal. Controversial collaboration with the UC military. Or Navy. Hey. They're all the same mechanically. But they all have different graphical things. Anyway. Captain, will be oh, hush. Chunks. Another tower. I'm just going to finish this one quest and then oh that's telling me to go to the transport nope not going that far so what's the point of what this is it some sort of art a zen garden Ooh. just wanted to go through the tunnel okay then we're going to go ahead and stop this here and after I stretch my leg because this is actually a very uncomfortable position for me I think we're just going to start yeah, back Yeah, we're going to play more. Let's go ahead and make a real save. And yes, I did save last time. I saved after stopping the recording. Anyway, I'll talk to you next time, Internet. And poor, poor Editor Spoon is going to have so much to work on. Bye! <laughs> poor Editor Spoon.